These guidelines were just issued by the American Academy of Pediatrics, and they say cheerleading needs to be designated as an official sport by the NCAA because it needs official rules to keep athletes safe. Now, if you've been to a cheer competition recently, you know things have changed quite a bit since the 80s. These days, gymnastics is a huge part of the sport, along with stunting and pyramids. Last year alone, there were 37,000 emergency room visits related to cheerleading injuries. And even though the rate of injury injuries in high school cheer is lower than other sports. The rate of catastrophic injuries, things like skull fractures and spine injuries, that's much higher. Now this doctor's group is recommending several changes. They say skills like tumbling and stunts should only be performed on soft surfaces, meaning stunts during basketball games would need mats. And they also say that pyramids should not be more than two people high. Now most high schools here in Michigan already abide by that rule, but some all-star teams and some college teams do not. Now some teams have already fired back saying these guidelines are too strict and they take out the most exciting parts of the sport. But these doctors say that if the goal is to keep your kids safe, these recommendations need to be carried out. That's latest in the newsroom. Kelly McDermott, 7 Action News. Yeah.